Industrial Zone. The girl. Born in the Ganymede fields, the girl felt the need to come back home. She brought her baggage, bringing prosperity into these poor and forgotten lands. The girl then felt this uncontrollable desire to seek more knowledge and found in Ganymede fields the perfect place. And then it of course changed the night. It changed the night time. Industrial zone. Yay. Okay. Oh, okay. So they're pretty much ratcheting up the intensity already because Okay, mind you, I have not seen my revenants yet, but I did... Okay. There haven't been any signs of revenants yet, but there have been signs of mancubi. I, I... 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 Okay. Sir. That was very impolite. Ow. Okay. In H Doom that he's called a Wankibus. Ah, the Wankibus. Why? Okay, how did I get boxed in? Alright, this is very very smart enemy placement. Not even frustrating because at least I have room to move. Oh yeah, the last map set I ended up playing before this was called Reverie. Uh, yeah. I ended up playing Reverie the last time and... It was very... Classic. In both the right and the wrong ways. Just a dumb joke on my end, I have no idea actually. Uh, let's... Let, I'd rather... I, I'd rather not find out. Ow! Although I would it would be kind of funny if that actually was the case, right? Okay. Oh no 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 no. Okay, it's safe to say that Deadwing likes his ambush trap uh Deadwood likes his monsters teleporting behind him, like that. Nothing personnel, kid. Ow. Yeah, okay. It's safe to say Deadwing likes his nothing personnel kid traps. Respectable. I can respect that. Damn it. Oh, frick off. Okay. Shit. Uh oh. That thing's come a long way since Moonblood. This one's actually fine. Like, this particular map is one example of him just. Really making good use, making full use of it, but it hasn't come to a it hasn't come to a point of ultra annoyance. It hasn't to come to a, that point. Not by a long shot, man. I remember when I oh okay, but he does really like this nothing personnel kid approach, huh? Nothing personnel kid. Kind of funny. Because he did make, wait, he did make a sequel to this called Exomoon, and then he made a sequel of this again called Ozonia. 
I was a play I was a play tester for Ozonia and it was his best work there. Yeah, I'll I'll get to Ozonia at some point. I'll get to Ozonia at some point. Oh, it takes me to that air okay. But anyway, yeah, so I recently played Reverie. Uh, and let's just say that it was very, very 90s. Almost to a fault. That was the last that was I think that was the last megawatt I played uh before switching to bolt gun. Let's see. I'm actually just like trying to remember everything off the top of my head, but okay, what the frick? Seriously. Wow Okay. That was uh I should have fired I should have fired immediately. Ow. I'm going to I'm gonna that was a face rocket. That was a shameful face rocket. Oh wow, 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 wow. I took no damage. This is the best opportunity I'll have any day. That is the best opportunity I will have any time. Okay, save. Okay, I do not want to be caught in that crossfire. Nope, 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 nope. Ow. Okay, my fault for actually just standing there and taking the hits. My fault for just standing there and taking the hits, but still. Not something you want to see. Oh yeah, I remember that the other thing that you do in Doom World is like play test a lot of people's maps. I guess I know I'm gonna be in good hands if I ever submit anything to do. If I ever submit anything to Doom World, I guess I I guess I'll know that I'm gonna be in good hands. I'm the community lab rat. As far as general feedback, yeah, but like, wait, I remember there was this one guy in Doom World who would give some of the most detailed feedback, very technical uh, detailed feedback, um, with regards to like line sector information. Uh, Hawkwing. Wait, Hawkwind, not Hawkwing, Hawkwind. It'll give you pretty much exactly the line, the sector count of which, uh, w which bugged here, which bugged what. But, you know, whenever... But as far as, like, general feedback goes, you're usually the guy I see who makes those comments, and I appreciate that. Yeah, I provide more of a purely ba player-based perspective. Yep, that's actually val that which is uh, which is very valuable. Doom engine shit might as well be magic to me, but like as far as uh, as far as how the maps play, the flow, appearance, yeah, I only have a rudimentary understanding. Dude, I didn't even know there was like. Bruh, you know when they when they sort of introduced the magic of what was that thing again? What what portal was that again? Apparently there's this sort of um 
this sort of doom mapping wizardry they call something portals that they just discovered recently. I was like, how? What? But also cool. But also what? I think it started with K. Something like K portals. I forget. Oh boy. I got... Okay. Okay. This time I'm prepared. Portals, you say? Yeah, I just forgot the actual term for it. Hang on. Yeah, not sure. Ring not ringing a bell for me at the moment. Then again, I do misremember. To be fair, I do rem misremember a lot of things, but... Oh, hey! Crates! Hey! We finally have a crate maze! Filled with pinkies and specters. And more rockets. Oh, of course. Of course. I hate this already. Every time I'm about ready to just fire my rockets. Oh my fucking. No, no. Just fuck off. Pain by name, pain by nature. Yep. I hate them. They always just have to be extra mean to me. What the frick? Okay. Oh, it's called the Miko Portal. That's it. Apparently some, uh, exploit some random Doom engine behavior. Yeah, that's the one I was looking for, the Miko portal. Like, the fact that people knew something about... Like, wait, such a thing exists in the Doom engine? 
How do these people even know about this? Pain by name, pain by nature, pain in the ass to fight. Every time. It's fun how the community can find new technical achievements and anomalies utilizing a 30-year-old game. Yeah, then. Doom is pretty much my reminder of my own mortality and age. Mostly the age. No, for fuck's sake, fuck off, will you? Doom is timeless, Doom is eternal. No, piss off. Just piss off. Hold on, give me one second. I'm not telling you to piss off, I'm telling these things to piss off. They should just not exist. Stop existing. Got back. Oh boy. Fuck! Okay, I'm really rusty. At this point in time, I think I, I can really just admit I'm rusty now. Fuck. And, well, maybe that doesn't help too. Maybe face may, maybe face rocketing doesn't help. But man, does it feel good to be It does feel good. I already miss this part of like I already miss this part of Doom Eternal. Or rather not Doom Eternal, this part of Doom in general. No, stay in your box. Stay in your box. Stay in your box. Do not come out of that box. Just don't. Ow. I've had almost zero interest in the new Doom games, but I'm glad they exist. They've been helping bring new blood into the classic Doom community. Yup! Also, hey, new blood. Hey, <laughs> new blood. I'm just saying, hey, <laughs> new blood. I don't know if that was intentional, but I liked it. I don't think that was a very that was intentional as a reference, but I like it. New blood. We hate money. Ah, you know, it's it's the simple pleasures in life that I missed. Um, you can actually press on doors again. Like, I think I remember there was this, yeah. I remember Reverie having a lot of these things where, um, I couldn't directly open doors by pressing space on them even if I had the key. I had to press a switch that would open the door. That's not very fun. When you do it, like, every map. Every damn map. It's not fun when it happens every freaking map. It's fun and it's okay in spurts, but like 
if I if there's a door in there that has blue bars, I expect to press space and open it, not look for a switch that opens it. Anyway... I can just face these guys. Okay, so for the most part, they should be wasted. Okay, now to find two more enemies and one more secret. But look, generally, the new blood guys are super duper chill. I like them a lot. And you know, the companies that work uh, that, that work with new blood as a publisher. I think I might. I think I might have ended up recommending or at least influencing people to get New Blood stuff because uh, I have a friend who really, really likes their horror games and they've been very interested in Faith. And then I pretty much just did nothing but shill for New Blood at that point. Like, holy crap, you guys know that... Did you guys know that Faith is basically published by New Blood? Who has published my fav some of my favorite new boomer shooters like Dusk and the Medieval, and I, I I feel very proud of that. Well, I think they made it too, but you know, devils in the details. Okay, I think the reason why you kill the shotgunner there is because uh, when you kill the shotgunner, did you hear about the Iron Lung movie Markiplier is making? Um, no, but I do know that there is an Iron Lung game by uh, Dave Oshry and the dudes is it are, are they making it in cooperation with New Blood or as a collaboration with New Blood yeah it's based on the game oh fair enough okay so the only thing Thing that's left is to figure out how to get the that last secret. Best part is they wrapped up production. He's busy editing it at this point. Let's go. We might see it come out the next year or so. Okay, head slightly west of secret number two. To hear something lower. Quickly turn around and head north until you find another lowered crate. No, that's not it. Oh, it's in the central room with the yellow door. Eto. I've already been to. That's about, well, I'm very happy about the computer area map, but at the same time, it's also useless because I literally just beat everything and I was just looking for the secret. Oh well, time to exit! Yay! 